Hello scrapbooking friends. Uh, I'm here working on a scrapbook of a walk I made on the beach while I was in Florida with my aunt. Uh, it is all laid out right now. I'll put it together soon. Uh, but just to let you know, cut the jellyfish using my Cricut machine and then also this little sun design. So we decided we were going to go out and watch the sunrise. So these are sunrise uh, pictures uh, from the beach. Uh, I guess I've already stuck that down and I've already matted um, the pictures. And you can see it kind of used a sun yellow background page uh, for the sunset and making sure we get the, the sun in there. And then I chose this orange background in some ways to match some of the colors in the pictures and it helps it to stand out uh, pretty nicely. So again, pre-matted all of this uh, just to save us some time. Uh, I normally put these big pages down with a nine point pattern and uh, I really usually just kind of eyeball this stuff. There we go. It's nice to have this mat. My mother gifted it to me. Uh, helps to keep everything straight and I can eyeball all the lines on it. Uh, also just used a piece of old photograph that keeps me from getting fingerprints on the photographs and keeps me from scratching them. I'm going to move that one just up, up just a little bit uh, while we work on this. Uh, this jellyfish was really uh, kind of fun to cut, complicated to put together, you, uh, but you can kind of see how it was, how it was done there. Uh, and then some fish, uh, jellyfish. I uh, chose brown on this side really to match uh, the colors of the beach. These things apparently are very poisonous and uh, we were very careful to make sure we didn't stand on one. Uh, I think they're called sailfish jellyfish. Uh, they put up these spines and then they just blow uh, to move across the top of the water. So it'd be pretty scary if you were swimming. Uh, to have one of those hit you. When I was growing up as a child uh, in South Africa, I got stung by a blue bottle jellyfish, and oof, I remember that to this day, how badly uh, that hurt. So, all right. I think for this jellyfish with these long, thin tentacles, I want to use my glue pen and uh, just to make sure that that get those ends get down. This glue pen is near to the end. There's still glue in there though, so I don't want to. I don't want to waste it. I'm filming this in the dark in the morning, just because I'm awake. So, don't have great external light, and all right, get it down, there we go. You can see I'm using the side of my hands, uh, just because I don't want to get any kind of palm sweat onto, onto it, but there it is. Uh, you can see I overlapped the photographs, you can still kind of see the main things. Uh, the main objects in the picture, but uh, like to do that sometimes when uh, you've got a picture with a lot of extra uh, material. Sometimes people cut the picture smaller, but then I find that that takes it out of the context and in this way uh, it's still in the context. So hope you're having a great day and enjoy scrapbooking. I look forward to seeing your creations. Take care.